Yo, what is up? Uh, as you can see, just give you a little bit of a view here and there. Um, I'm not gonna probably record inside. I'll probably do that part three of the part uh, the third day. Uh, but here we are, part two. Yeah. Yo, what is up guys, uh, basically, uh, that was pretty much it from the part of that outside part, I did not get to record anything, uh, like I said, from the beginning, I'm gonna have to try to do it on the third day, honestly, I hate when my batteries try to, like, somehow, I charge it, honestly, I charge it, uh, but I have to probably have to charge it inside as well. Uh, trying to give you guys a more of a skill on skill, like not a skill on skill, but like a more view of the facility and everything. Um, yeah, I did get that one picture, and and I've been like running around in there. Honestly, I didn't get to take any pictures. I just got to took that one picture, uh, but. At least I get to show you some of the items that I did get when I was there. So, we got a brand new Pokeball here. So now I can just uh, open up and put my Squirtle that I, I showed you guys in the other video of that Squirtle. So I put that Squirtle in there and, you know, since I got in the Pokeball from that day, from today being there um, I also got this cup here well not cup but like a bottle where you can put your water in and I got the whole Squirtle evolution between Squirtle or Turtle and then the Blastoise evolution here and that was pretty cool how they have this uh, bottle so where you can just put your drinks in here it's like one of those bike bottle things you know, basically, I was like, cool, I need it, you know, so, got that, um, let's see if I can just grab it over here, I got this shirt that's pretty awesome, and since eventually Tanami is gonna eventually show up there, uh, I got this shirt, and I was like, yes, I need this shirt, honestly, I do need this shirt. So, I noticed uh, me and Masuki was talking about another shirt that had to do with Pokemon. And basically, we, we added a, a little, you know, sentence to it. Basically, a little additional sentence to it. Well, not a sentence, but an answer to that sentence. Basically. So, if you, you ever seen this shirt, it says, uh, basically, Pikachu uses Flash. And it shows Pikachu, um, flat, like has like a coat basically and flashing the other opponent and then you have Sota who's basically be that opponent getting flashed and he's like okay you know so it was cool I was like yeah eventually you're just gonna have to wear these shirts and you know get that little comedy joke out of it basically uh so that's where I got from the expo. Uh, there is another thing I also got from the expo that I am very happy about. Let me just back this up a little bit so I can move it over. Okay. So I have officially gotten this thing here. It's a lightsaber. So, and I kind of wanted the lightsaber from, uh, what you call it? Online, where they went to Gangel Online, where uh, Kirito got his little lightsaber. Uh, basically, I wanted the one that he had it, where it's all purple. But this one goes super bright. Let me just try to get a little bit backer. It's super bright. This color is green right now, so it's green right now, and then it changes to red, and then it changes to blue. So it's pretty cool. I mean, it's pretty bright, but it's pretty cool at the same time. As you'd be like, <laughs> you know, 
There we go. So it got a little bit extra light in there, you know, in the background where it's bright enough, but you know, there you go from that. So I got that and then I got another sword that's kinda like Kirito official sword. So here you go. Kirito's official sword here. I added I basically got a little belt thing for it so I could hold the sword and put it around my back and have it like that. So it is a real sword. Look at that. Nicely done and made real sword. It's pretty awesome. I'm basically gonna have it hanged up. I'm not gonna use the sword, it's just a collectible sword, you know, not for use. Just you know to hang it around and show it off you know, to friends and stuff like that. Then I have, and in the fact that for cosplaying, so I have that for cosplaying basically. Then I have this second sword that's from Kirito as you can see here. I saw a couple of other shorts that I wanted from Kirito that was there. Uh, his big blade that he got from AFL. Was uh, AFO? Uh, uh, what was it called? I forgot what it was called, but it was the whole thing with the whole fairy, basically. And I seen it, and I was like, "Oh, that's the sword I want." So maybe next time I could go and I get that sword, and then that will be the third sword that I get. Excuse me. And I could just you know, add it onto here, and then have it also on my back. So it'll be like one sword this way, one sword that way, and then one sword in the middle, basically. Then uh, there's one more sword that I need to get as well that belongs to Kirito. Basically, it's the Excalibur sword. Uh, once I get that, that's pretty much a done deal for me, and I'll have like the whole set right there. Then. Uh, that's pretty much it that I got from today, but this is basically this is a sword that he got off the first season though. This, this is the second sword when he said like, oh, okay, I could do a dual, dual, a dual blade sword. He can use more than one sword. So, and like I said, it is a real sword, but I'm only using this sword for cosplay usage. I'm not gonna take it out of the sheath when I'm. Over there, it's gonna be in a sheath, it's gonna be on my back, it's not gonna be used at all. Like I said, it's just gonna be like something that I'll hang around, cosplay with, and I take it from off of my back, it's gonna stay there on my back, do the whole expo, it's not gonna be taken off. I mean, I might take it off my back, but other than that, it's just, it's not gonna be taken from out of the sheath. So, that's pretty much all I got from the expo. I mean, I could do a recap of what I got from there. Basically, the whole squirrel, the whole blastoid, uh, this shirt right here, uh, uh, what was the other thing? Basically, that's pretty much it. You know, the fact that I got the cup, the other Pokeball. Uh, the other shirt, the sword here. I pretty much gotten everything to the point, but that's pretty much it, you know. Honestly, looking at my gym badges in the background, but you know, uh, that's pretty much all I got for this expo for today. Like I said, I'll eventually start getting a little bit more recording in for the next day. Hopefully I get a more wide view of everything instead of having it just like that part and then nothing. I'll probably just get a little bit more of a picture, picture if anything. I probably won't like get like a video recording of everybody just like pictures wise basically. I'll just do a montage of pictures basically and get that done in a way. So that's gonna be good. Um, uh, 
yeah, pretty much. Honestly, that's all I'm gonna be doing for the next two more days. Probably do like picture montage, get everything out there, you know, just taking pictures. I'm not gonna probably like do any video recordings, but I will get pictures up basically because I know a lot of you guys want to see more of a longer video, this and that. Probably not even a longer video, probably a short video, if anything, but at least, you know have some pictures in there basically pretty sure you guys want to see some cosplay stuff some cosplay pictures pretty sure you do guys want to see that um yeah i want to get the heck out of here comment share scrub us the like button pitch squirrel shape on stay awesome guys bye